Now let's solve both the systems of equations by substitution. And of course we want to solve for both x and y for both questions. Starting over here, we have y equals 5x plus 2 and y equals 4x minus 3. So how does substitution work? Well, let's take a look here. We have y equals 5x plus 2. So I'm just going to substitute this into the other equation, 4y, so I can rewrite this y as 5x plus 2, and the other side of the equation will be the same, 4x minus 3. Then I can just solve for x. So we just substituted 5x plus 2 into the equation, thereby getting rid of the y. That's what we wanted to do. Now let's just solve for x. So we can subtract 4x from both sides of the equation. 5x minus 4x is just x plus 2 equals negative 3. Then I can just subtract 2 from both sides of the equation. And x is equal to negative 3 minus 2, negative 5. Excellent. Now, how do we solve for y? I can just plug the x value back into the equation. So y is equal to 5 times negative 5 plus 2. So 5 times negative 5, negative 25 plus 2, negative 23. That's it. So the solution to our equation is, or to, sorry, to our system of equations is just x equals negative 5 and y equals negative 23. You can write this as a coordinate x comma y.